Hi everyone and welcome back to another episode of High on Life. Let's continue and see what happens. This game has been nothing but amazing so far. Hello. Hey, uh, did, did you know anything about Dr. Giblets? What are you talking about? Hey there, it's me, Sudo. Looks like you're trying to interrogate a suspect. Let's ask them some questions. Oh my god. Why do you look so nervous? Why do I look nervous? <laughs> oh jeez, you're making me nervous with this interrogation. <laughs> Are you a Dr. Giblets? Am I what? What is it with you and this Dr. Giblets guy? My name's Craig and I'm really sick from eating a lot of sandwiches. Leave me alone. Okay, okay, where is he? I'm really sorry, I don't know who that is. But <laughs> good luck, I guess. Hope you find them. What? Why do you care? Well, if you must know, I ate 15 whole sandwiches. And yes, I regret it. I don't know why I ate that many. Woof, they didn't know anything. That was a real D-rank interrogation. Sorry. Oh well, maybe you could just find more people to interrogate. You'll get it next time. Okay, let's see. Hi, guys. Oh, whoops. Sorry about that. Uh, <laughs> this is the trial version of detective mode. So there's going to be ads. You love ads. This will be worth it. I promise. Oh, my God. Hey, uh, hey, tough guy. We're, we're looking for a Dr. Giblets. You got, you got any leads? Slick, what the fuck are you talking like that for? Oh, Jesus Christ, leave me alone. Where is I don't he? Know, and I don't give a shit. I'm busy. You need anything else or can I fucking go? Okay, no, he doesn't Ooh, know. Bummer, they were a tough cookie. But they were telling the truth according to my sensors. So let's say that was a C-rank interrogation. Better luck next Everybody, time. that's Globo Bogo on the drums. Holy shit, he's got a crowd. We did this. <laughs> Guys, look at him. He's rocking out. Yeah, he's really something. You know, th this is all thanks to you, you know, and the time you took to get him that drum. God bless you. Nice. Keep it up, Globo. Keep it up. Rock on, Globo. Okay. Who can we interrogate? Hello. Hey, uh, do, do you mind if we have a moment of your time? Oh, uh, sure. Uh, what's this about, can I ask? I don't know. We need to find someone. Shh, hey, quiet. Don't say his name so loud. I can't help you, but Blordo can. Mention my name, Michael Taint. Then he'll talk. But no cracks about my name. Holy dry. shit, wow. You, we actually got something we can use. Okay, woo -hoo. That was an A-rank interrogation. Good for you. Let's head over to Blordo and mention Michael Taint. Oh, here. Hello. Hey, what's up, Lordo? You know anything about a, a, a where we could find a guy named Jib, Dr. Giblets? Whoa, 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 where'd you hear that name? You can't just go asking around town for a guy like that. What, why? What, what, what's wrong with asking about Dr. Giblets? I don't know. Why do you think I know anything about Dr. Giblets? I don't know nothing. Now buy something, I'll beat it, buster. No, Michael Taint said you knew something. Ah, that piece of shit! I'm gonna kill him! Ah, look, if you're really looking for trouble, maybe check out the new High on Life store in the slums. The Hyperbong 6 Midnight launches tonight, but you should be able to get in by now. Just don't mention my name. I didn't say nothing. Now get out of here! If anyone sees me talking here, I'm dead! Thanks, Blordo. We, we had a good feeling you were a true pal. Whoa! <laughs> great sleuthing, detectives! That was an S-rank interrogation! I was playing along for a second. Hello, hello! Oh, Hi, guys! You. Back to hurt my feelings again? Leave them alone! Hey, what's up, best friend? Don't wait in that crowd full of nerds! You head right on through! <gasps> Shit, thank you! Thank you! We are making friends, guys. We are definitely making friends. Alright. Okay, so we're looking for this new high on oh, life yeah, store. Hey, hey, yeah. Hopefully the slums uh, are a little again, more chill now that we took out Nine Torg. Like, Nobody wants to talk to hey, both like We heard you were asking around for giblets. Uh, whoa, today, whoa. Topic day. Oh, what's going on? 
got me. There's more of them. There's more? I never considered oh. that I might actually die. There you go. God, there's so many. You just got squashed. Squashed. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, okay. Hey, what the fuck? You're not gonna fight us? Yeah, sorry. I hope you're not insulted. No time for fighting here. We got, we're trying to solve a mystery. It's kind of a different sort of mechanic, different system. Let's go, let's go. But I, I don't like what they're doing over here to this place. It's, it just feels weird. Okay, we got these. Come on. Get ready for another wave, bounty hunter. Oh, no. Oh, come on, man. Back up. Where are they? If only they were all this week, you know? <laughs> There you go. Oh my god. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's been a little while since you used me last. I totally get it. I'm a genetic freak. I would not want to touch me either. Hello, you fucked up all my Take these. Where did you go? Oh, he's not reaching hey. that far. I'm hey. in the real battle now. <laughs> the little ones are so funny. <gasps> whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Are you friendly? Hmm. Where are you? Step on your ass. Ow. Oh, my God. I think this is my favorite gun, to be honest, All right, guys. That, that, that's got to be the high on life store. I feel like all of them are unique, but I like this one the most. And I'm gonna buy hey, don't worry, more. detectives Trust can always me. cut lines. The rules do not apply to the law. Oh, thank God they opened this new high on life store. Hello. Welcome to High on Life Store number 7923. 
your local Hyperbong Superstore. Please, no traveling of other patrons during the midnight launch. Okay. Well, well, well. I smell another mystery. I'm Pseudo, by the way. You know me. Uh, yeah, we're, we're still tracking down giblets. Yeah, you already know what I'm gonna say. Try interrogating all the employees here. Yeah, no shit. That's what, that's what the fuck we're gonna do. <laughs> Hello, and welcome to High on Life. How can High on Life help you today? Is this store connected to the G3? High on Life employees are not authorized to admit that we have ties to the criminal organization known as the G3. But can I offer you membership in our High on Life care program? Is this illegal? illegal? No, 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 not, not in any real sense. You must be reading some of our detractors on the internet or watching too many Clug Nugman speeches. Hyperbongs are totally humane and of no harm to anybody except the creatures you smoke in them. Oh, <laughs> right. Why would you build a store in the slums? We actually prefer not to call it the slums. This is an exciting new up and coming part of town that we hope will attract a youthful new demographic ready to spend their hard earned money on quality products. Speaking of which, can I interest you in a Hyperbong 6? And what do you sell Great here? Great question. Thanks so much for your interest. We sell Hyperbongs and Hyperbong accessories. The latest model, the Hyperbong 6, is even capable of smoking humans. That's right. That hot new species you've been hearing about, high on life Hyperbongs, are the only way to get that fix. Woo, these are some tough nuts to crack. Don't lose motivation. You're doing great. But you do get a D ranking because that one sucked. A D ranking? I felt like that was so good. Oh, hello. Holy shit, this is a madhouse. Oh, 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 sorry. Hi, thanks for shopping at High on Life. I'm the manager here. Are, are you finding everything okay? Where can I find? Oh, man, this again. Look, man, I just work here. I don't know anything about the store or who built it. Or I'm, I'm kind of a fuck up. I lied on my resume. I got this manager gig. I never even met Dr. Giblets. I, I don't know what he looks like. I couldn't even point him out in a crowd. But, but you know about him. Yeah, yeah, sure I do. He owns this place. He never comes around, though. I don't really know where he is. Hmm... So you're the That's manager right. here? It's a big day. I didn't think there'd be this many people lining up to buy hyper bongs. Probably a bad sign for our city. Tell us where he is. What? I told you. I have no idea where he is. And you're being really aggressive. Leave me alone. It's super fucking busy right now. And you're distracting the hell out of me. Okay, oh. shit. Not, not so good. It looks like we've uh, hit, a, hit a dead end. So let's get the fuck out of here and just give up on being detectives. It's all done now. Return home and regroup with Jean. Nice day for a shopping trip, ain't it? It sure is. I know I'd go shopping on a day like this. Except this wannabe bounty hunter doesn't seem to be shopping. That's right. Seems like they're poking their beak where it don't belong. Be a shame if something happened to your beak as a result if you catch our drift. More of this shit? Are you fucking kidding me? More? More of this? Why is everybody on our case today? Please, just fuck off! You got a fresh mouth on you, kid. Be a shame if something happened to that mouth as a result. Part of my associate here, yeah? he's only got one good threat, but I assure you, he can back it up. That's right. A word to the wise. Stay out of this. Got it? We <laughs> got this covered. What the hell was that? Oh my god, guys. Holy shit, what, what the fuck? Was, was this guy trampled to death? Uh, yeah. My friend Davy Glutes got trampled in the rush. Pretty sad, right? One moment he was there, next he's gone. Squashed. Oh my god. Oh, you can go ahead and take his bag boots. It's not a problem. He was a really bad guy. Like morally, he was very fucked up. Bad morals. Shouldn't have been friends with him really. Not really a good idea. Don't know really why I liked him so much. Mag boots. A lot of people think mag boots is short for magnetic boots because they have magnets on their soles and you can use them to walk on magnetic surfaces. Well, those people are right. That's exactly what it stands for. No twist here. Nice. Yeah, that's fine. You can totally take those mag boots. Okay, look, I know this is a little fucked, but these boots are going to be very useful and, and they're the only way out of here. Well, you know. Hey, sick moon. 
You're making good use of that. Oh those my god. Boots. Using those things way better than Davy Glutes ever did. Look at you! Stop. Oh my god, this is awesome. Okay, okay. Just keep coming. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Sniper. Another wave, no problem. No problem. Wait, do we need to go down? I think we do. Oh. <laughs> nice. This is amazing. again don't worry they're cool we've been observing you hope that don't rustle your jimmy's none because newsflash buckos we're on your side we'd like to formally apologize for how we treated you earlier we didn't realize who we were dealing with you'll have to forgive us and we're sorry we still sound like we're intimidating you it's the only way we know how to talk our wives hate us who sent you here we represent magistrate clug nugman maybe you've heard of him he's certainly heard of you Friends Here's the him. skinny slim. The Torg family, or what's left of it anyway. They got mixed up with a bad crowd. The G3 cartel. Or more specifically, Dr. John Giblet's PhD. And Clug wants it squashed. Pronto. He says you're the right bounty hunter for the job. Says you're already helping him. Says the G3 is our common enemy. We've got a lead on Dr. Giblet. He's been whooping all over, leaving behind a nice little warp trail for us. We're thinking you can follow those breadcrumbs all the way to the gingerbread house. That way Clug don't have to get his cute little hands dirty. You dig? We were already planning to... This kid's fast. Yeah, check out Dale Earnhardt Jr. over here. Let's say somebody dies. Maybe, hypothetically, their name is Dr. Giblets. Well, should anything like that happen, we had nothing to do with it. We didn't even mention it. This conversation never happened. And Clug will be very grateful. Speaking of which, why don't you follow us? Clug wants to speak in person. Huh, all right, let's, let's go talk to Clug. Let's go. Oh, welcome back. Thank you so much for all your help. Yeah, they've been aces. Yeah, real pros. Hey, Clug. <laughs> Sorry about those two. They can be a bit intense. Really, I don't know why they talk like that. But look, you've seriously done so much for me. I hate to ask for anything else, but this election is really close. And, well, keeping the G3 out of blim, it's really going to help me lock this in. Do you think you could, you know, deal with... Dr. Giblets? Well, yeah, no, I mean, we that's what we want to do, you know? But uh, it's just the trail went dead. A dead end? Oh, no, we can't have that. Let me just leave this map data right here on my desk. Not sure what 
Might be on it. Oh, that's how we get to Dr. Giblets? Whoa, whoa, even if this map data did take you to Dr. Giblets, we're not 100% sure it would be his actual base. You'll still need to do some detective work. Fuck yeah. All right, then we just kick <laughs> the door down, burst our way in there, find him, grab him by the neck. Hey, 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 I can't officially tell you to do that. Not if I want to win this next election, at least. <laughs> Good luck out there, bounty hunter. Uh, we will do our best. Thank you, thank you. Bye, guys. Oh. Magistrate Clug came through. He pointed us right to Dr. Giblets. That's great. It's I'm kind of regret not voting for him. Fucking weird. I get out there and kill Giblets. The same stratosphere as us. Use the portals tab of the bounty to explore previously visited worlds. Oh, I see. Is that a camera? Yeah, I made you a TV show, buddy. Yeah, you always wanted a TV show. All right, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Incoming. Oh, no. So nice with the jetpack. <gasps> no. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hold out. We need to go from here, right? Oh yeah, we've been here before. Hi guys. Oh no. Oh my god. Hold on a second. Okay, we need to go here. Take this. Sniper detected. God, there's so many. Oh. 
Okay. Ow, shield broken. Ready, bounty hunter? No, I'm ready, but hold up. How do we get there? Wait, is it through here? Yes, the boots. They are so good. Help. Nice. Help. I, I, I'm dying. Uh, oh, thank oh. God. Thank God someone's here. I, I'm, I'm, I'm losing consciousness. Oh. Oh. oh my god, what, what, what happened? A G3 base warped right through here. Right, 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 right where I was. And, uh, well, well it shot me uh, right in half. I got cut in half. A, G a G3 base? Oh my god, it was probably Dr. Giblets. Oh god, oh god, I'm fading fast. Please, please, please just stay with me while I die. I, I, I don't want to be alone. I don't want to be alone. Okay, hang in there, hang in there. We're, we'll stay with you as long as it takes. No, no, it, it's my time to go. Oh, thank you for, for staying with me. As I die, oh, just, just don't leave. Okay, and I feel it. Here I go. Oh, I'm, I'm dead. Oh no! I'm dead. Oh. Fuck! That rips my heart out. No. Hey, hey, hey! Where, where are you guys going? You, you oh. promised me you'd stay with me until I, until I die. Hey, hey! Thanks for coming back. Are you really dying? You, you, you sound fine now. <laughs> no, 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 oh, oh! I'm dying. No, I'm actually, oh, not uh, for real this time though. Oh my God! Oh, stay! Don't go anywhere. Stay with me. Thank you. Oh, here, here I go. Oh my God. Oh. oh. All right. Shit. I, I, I guess that's it then. Hmm. Hey, hey, what the fuck? You left me again. I'm, I'm not dead yet. If you leave me again, I swear to God, I'm gonna kill myself. I thought you were already dying. Oh, whoops, whoops. Never, never mind. I, I, I'm really, I'm really dying now. <laughs> now this, oh, for real. This, the, but this time is the real one. Oh, good, good. I can feel it. Oh, fuck. Oh, this really hurts. Good, good, goodbye. I, oh, oh. Okay, this time it's got to be real. Let, let, let's just get out of here. It's it's depressing. Hey, hey guys, I'm still alive. You, you... No, I don't. We can't watch that. It actually breaks my heart. Is he good? I, I'm, I'm fine now. I'm yeah, fine he's now. fine. I, I don't he's think fine. I'm gonna... Oh shit! He's gonna I guess be he really fine. did finally die. No, he's fine. Okay, so is this Dr. Giblets' base? Where, where the hell is he? Oh, well, I'm sure we'll be able to find Dr. Giblets with just a little bit of detective work. Let's look around for clues. Jesus Christ. Okay, okay, fine. Oh, that's a lot of dead bodies. Oh. What do you think happened in here? Whatever it was, it's not a good situation for everyone who died. But it's great for us to detect someone was killing G3 mercs. You know what? That makes sense. Everyone hates the G3. I bet people try to kill them all the time. I mean, look at you. That's what you're doing. Hmm, a destroyed drone. Looks like it was deployed for combat. Nothing fishy there. That's what they're used for. That's what drones are for. They're for combat. That's not weird to see a destroyed drone. All right. Anything else here? Hmm. Oh, up here. Here? Looks like your typical work desk. Nothing too crazy. Uh, uh, you know, best I can guess is someone interrupted Dr. Giblets while he was doing experiments. I don't know. I'm just throwing stuff at the wall here. Okay, yeah, I think I'm getting a sense of what happened here. Someone beat us to the punch. They attacked Dr. Giblets and all his men. Oh, we need more information. Let me hack the door so we can go deeper and look for more clues. All right then, let's let's keep moving. Let's keep moving. Howdy there, cowboys. Uh, oh shit, sorry, wrong bit, wrong bit. I mean, howdy there, detectives. Ew. Ooh, this looks like the lab where Dr. Giblets did his experiments. There's got to be something helpful in here. Let's get to scanning. These must be old hyperbong prototypes, way jankier than the ones they're selling at the High on Life store. Well, you know, we just pointed these out. Now we can move on to the next thing. Okay. 
Queer, look at all these drone heads. Dr. Giblets was an expert at creating cybernetic organisms. But we already knew that. You know, I don't think this is a very helpful clue. I do think it's neat, though. It's cool to look at fucked up drone heads. Thanks for showing me this. Was he doing experiments on his own henchmen? Jesus Christ, that's fucked up, right? Yeah, that's fucked up. I know it's fucked up. I don't know why I asked. I knew it was fucked up. Dr. Giblets must have been losing his mind. All right, here's my new theory. Dr. Giblets was even more twisted than we could ever imagine. He was torturing his own henchmen. He wasn't right in the head. Although I guess that's what Douglas did too, so maybe that's normal for the G3. Maybe he was normal. No way to know unless we go deeper. I'm hacking the next door. All right. All right, I got no fucking idea what this room is, but I'm sure there's more clues in here, so go, go find more clues, baby. Baby. Are these second place trophies? They're trophies for, for what? Science? Just science in general? Do they really give out second place trophies for science? Jeez, it looks like Dr. Dibbles was pissed he didn't get first place in, in science. Oh shit, that's a G Gatlian. A regular old Gatlian doesn't look like it's in good health at all. Probably should just let it be, honestly. Aha, so that's our murder weapon. Dr. Giblets must have used that modified Gatlian to attack his men. It's pretty powerful, did a lot of, did a lot of damage. It'd be great if we could somehow get that Gatlian for ourselves. You think that's gonna happen? Uh, who knows, let's find out. <laughs> let's find out. Okay. Oh boy, did Dr. Giblets write this? He was really paranoid, huh? He really thought people were trying to kill him. And you know what? Uh, he, he was right, because that's exactly what we're here to do. So, okay, he was right. Not crazy. Normal guy. Okay, I think we finally cracked this case. Dr. Giblets really did go insane. He was paranoid that someone was after him, so he killed his own men. While you were wasting time doing detective work, I was busy scanning the area for Dr. Giblets and decrypting the password on his security systems. Now you can just follow the waypoint right to him. Wait, so we didn't have to find any of those clues? Yep, sorry. I just love detective mode so much, I didn't want you to stop using it. Now go kill Dr. Giblets. Oh, let's go. Oh my god. Hi. Jesus! I think that's Dr. Giblets. Uh, that was uh, very anticlimactic, but I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not complaining. Jesus Christ, that was the easiest one yet. All right, let me add him. All right. Dr. Giblets status report. No life sense detected. Entering full security lockdown. Uh -oh. Oh, that's not if you good. This pre-recorded message, it means you've successfully managed to murder one of the greatest minds in all of super science. Congratulations, you killed me. But I you understand it, Cub, and I was prepared for this moment. Now see if you can survive my retribution from beyond the grave. I should have fucking known it wouldn't have been so easy. No. Everyone called me crazy, but look at me now. I'm dead. Get some more and more. I'm recording this message in the event that you're wearing a jetpack and you use it during the fight. I don't really have anything to say about it. I just wanted to cover all my bases here. Good work using the jetpack. But it won't be enough. 
Okay, is, is that it? Hmm. If you're hearing this, it means you made it past my first onslaught. Perhaps you weren't my son, Primothy. Yes. Yes, I was wrong. How could I have been so blind? I know who killed me now. It was you, Krubus. What, what is what? He, he thinks Krubus killed him? Jake, yes! <laughs> Jesus Christ, how many of these did he record? Oh my god. Always complaining about being the lowest rung on the G3 ladder. You thought you could kill me and take my spot at the top, didn't you? Well, think again, because, well, you did kill me, actually, but I'm going to kill you back. How appropriate, Chris, that after all those years stuck behind mountains of paperwork, you finally got to get your hands dirty again, just like you wanted. Hey. Well. Get with it. I with analogies. Krubus, could this actually be about the time that I slept with your wife? Oh. And then I made her do an experiment for me and she died in that process? And you swore revenge against me for the rest of the day? Not, but I just want to make sure. I know you can't tell me because I'm dead, but soon you can tell me. In hell! Oh my god. What is going on? Okay, I, th I think that's probably it. Alright, if you're still alive, you can't be Krubus. Krubus was too weak. That would have killed him. No, no, you must be someone else. But who is it? Who killed me? Was it. You, Douglas? You never told me your last name! Now he thinks it was Douglas? Happy to help. Douglas, you always were unpredictable. Your relentless party habits always landed you in hot water with our management. Perhaps you wish to strike back against our leader by killing his entire scientist. Me! That would certainly hurt his feelings. But it was a mistake to think you could just walk out of here alive! How do their bodies even work? Douglas, I remember that party where you could make it and experiment with one of the Squindle brothers. It was really hot. I even took photographs. Perhaps oh no! It's so nice to be back in your hands. Douglas, I remember that party where you could make it. That's why you killed me. Great, good work. Wanna go to Applebee's? Still alive, are you? Yes, we are. Been you. How moronic of me to assume otherwise. You're the most obvious suspect. Nipulon. Nipulon? He, he's the second in command. You've been here from the start. Gramantuous is favorite right Oh my man. god. You always hated the attention he gave me. You wanted them all for yourself. Could be told. I always was scared of you. Whoa. Just imagine what evils you're capable of. I'm not even sure I get to feed you. But I have to try. There's a wrong for it. You get really an afterlife waiting for you. How are you faring, Nipula? I'm still holding in there. I knew you'd be tough. It's one thing to serve in the G3, but it's another altogether to fully embody its ideology. I really did respect you when I was alive, but then you killed me. So it pains me, but I must kill you back. Oh, this is not good. Be helpful, you know? You're a tough one, Nipulon. I'm throwing everything I have at you, but can you survive this entire base self-destructing? Okay, I'll have to remember to rig that up later and time it with this video. Note to self, rig up base to self-destruct. Rig up base to self-destruct. Rig up base, okay. Ouchie. Consider that an early retirement.
Okay. We need to escape the base. Whoa. continue to study these humans I find them to be more complex than I ever could have expected initially I saw great potential in both the Fergals and the Gatlians but now I see how foolish I was those were nothing but dead ends humans however humans are going to change everything god damn what the fuck was the G3 doing with this guy hmm Oh, uh, yeah, well, you know what? Is, is he even alive? Uh, you know what? L let's take him back to Gene. Gene knows. He can fix, get him all fixed up. I'm drawing this goal. I just wanted to say, you know, to, today really meant a lot to me. And, um, uh, God, <laughs> uh, this is so fucking hard. Um, your free trial of detective mode is up. So see you later. Bye. Bye. Oh, Thanks for thank your help. God. Okay, bounty hunter, you go through the menus. You find that detective mode. You shut it the fuck off. Never again. Okay, <laughs> I'm serious. Delete it. J delete. Hey. Whoa. Oh, right look Come. at that. Oh. Hey. You found Dr. Giblets all by yourself. See? It's not so easy figuring out where these bozos are. Let it go. Come on over. Let's pow wow. Yeah, I made you a TV it's show. It's pow wow. What? Yeah, you always wanted a TV. Okay, uh, so we did find Dr. Giblets. Um, he is dead, but we also found another Gatlian. Oh shit, that's great. I, 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 I don't know about that. I mean, he, he's, he's not really functional. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't think he's dead, but. Oh, God damn. Yeah, he's busted up real bad. What were they doing to him? Do you, do you think he's salvageable? Buddy, I'm not gonna promise you I can save him. That would be irresponsible of me. You would be careless to toy with your emotions like that. But yes, I can definitely fix it. Okay, th thanks, Gene. But you know, if, if he can't be saved, it, it wouldn't be, uh... What was that? Uh, nothing. I, 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 I was being shitty. You, you didn't hear me. You, I don't want you to hear me being shitty. Yeah, okay. Weird thing to say, but whatever. Sorry to change the subject, but, uh... Turn in your bounty real quick. I've got some good news and some bad news. Oh, no. Not the bad news. Okay. Okay. Come on over. Let me give you the... All right, what do you got for us, Gene? All right. Which do you want first? The good news or the bad news? Oh, the bad right. news. Here's the bad news. Lizzie's been gone for a while. It's probably nothing, and I'm obviously not actually worried or anything because I, I hate her. But, uh, you know, you, you might want to look into it since she's your sister and all. Maybe check with Tweeg. He works at that Space Applebee's uptown. Mm, and the good news? Right, well, I lied, kid. I don't have any good news. I was hoping you'd just ask for the bad news, and then you'd be so upset you'd forget to ask about the good news. Uh, I was trying to pull a fast one on you, and I failed. So, uh, this is pretty embarrassing. Uh, so, uh, yeah, that's everything. I'll work on getting us some new bounty leads if you want to go look for Lizzie. And, uh, 
I'm gonna see if I can fix up that busted Gatlion you saved. Jesus, that is a lot to take in, Gene. Hey, uh, Bounty Hunter, you mind if we leave the other Gatlions here with Gene and maybe we can go poke around for Lizzie and use that time to have a little chat with each other? You know, just you and me, uh, our favorite people, our favorite, uh, you and I, our best pals. Can we do this with just you and me? You know, we can leave them with Gene, the other guns. You know, yeah. they, they're not gonna mind. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, oh sure. my God! It's nice to stretch out a bit, you know. Take a little nappy poo. Oh yeah. Ugh. Change the channel, Gene, to porn. Have a good time, you two. We'll hold down the four. All right, bounty hunter. Let's head to Applebee's and we're, let's find your sister. <laughs> this is awesome. All right, guns. No funny business while the bounty hunter's away. Look at us, just you and me again, you know, just like old times, like the dream team, you know? Uh, so Applebee's, it's in the slums, which you, you know, you, you probably knew that, so your suit can point us in the right direction. So you take the lead, bounty hunter. You, you, you know, we'll talk with, you know, we'll, we'll, we're gonna, we're, we're gonna chat. It's gonna be good. It's gonna, it's all good. Don't worry about this. Don't get shooken up about the, I don't, I, there's no reason to be, uh, you know, d don't feel <laughs> weird or anything. I'm not trying, you know what I mean? Alright guys, let's end the episode here. This has been awesome. Right, can, you're talking to yourself now. They can hear you. It's not so hard. Just tell them everything. I like this game so, so much. I hope you guys like it too. I can't wait to see if we get more guns. What happens. And most importantly, we need to find Lizzie. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye.